It's been uh, five years since television presenter Gail Porter lost all her hair from alopecia, a stress-related condition which affects more than a million people. Gail chose not to wear a wig and has since become a role model for hair loss sufferers. Well, Gail's story has a happy ending. Almost all her hair has grown back in recent months. She's here to tell us about it now. A wash with um, a gothic... Yes. <laughs> I know, I'm all... <laughs> bling, bling. I'm all blinging up and everything. Yes, sorry. So, <laughs> and, and the hair. I know, it's ridiculous. I'm... Uh, I don't want to get too excited because I know people with alopecia that I've got their hair back before and then it's fallen out. So, um, you know, I'm just enjoying it, playing with it, and it's very thick. It wasn't supposed yeah, to happen, though, was it? No, well, my doctor, well, I went to see a specialist and I, I did a documentary about alopecia, and he said, because I had alopecia totalis, so it was everything, my eyebrows, you know, all my body hair, which was great. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Now yeah. you must have saved a fortune on oh, waxing. absolute fortune and no pain and nothing. And now I've got to shave my legs. And oh, how annoying. Oh, yeah, don't. Oh, don't, 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 because otherwise, like, like, yeah, you know, <laughs> so we have to keep him on board here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and, and, and your hair came back yeah. dark. It came back black. Well, it was kind of little patches. And then it... Um, it started to come back more, and, I, and it's just, it's bizarre. I've got this bit here that looks like I've got a small sideburn. <laughs> but, you know, I'm, I'm just enjoying all of it. So. And, and you've decided to dye it? Yes, yeah. Uh, is that OK? Does that not stress well, it out? I'm sure it's probably not, but I've had five and a half years of being completely bald. I'm just having fun, and, you know, what's the worst that what's can happen? What's the explanation? Hmm? What's the explanation for it coming well, back when they said it wouldn't come back? They, um, they said it was um, stress-related, mm. but, I mean, there's... So many people are stressed in, in this, well, all, all over the world, but I, I don't know. I mean, I, I've got no idea. It's a very, you know, they say it could be hormones, it could be, you know, um, an imbalance of something, mm. but they always put it down to stress. But I wasn't really that stressed. I was kind of stressed. Are you less stressed now than you were then? I am much less stressed than I, I was then. And yeah. is that partly to do with the fact you've got a daughter? Yes. Oh, who's honey. watching? Where am I? Hi, Hello. hi, honey. And she's staying at Jemima's. Hi, Jemima. Hi, honey. I promise this morning. Uh, uh, OK, Thank right. So, but, but the fact that you've got honey there yep. um, perhaps means that you're uh, perhaps sort of less concentrating on, on you and your, and your problems because you've actually got a, 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 another yeah, little... Another little Another person. little person there. I think the oldest she gets as well, you know, you, you've got children. Yeah. Um, yeah. And uh, I think, you know, it, it's just you, you do concentrate on, on other things. And, you know, I don't know, really. It's a really difficult situation. Uh, the, the only thing that upsets me is when people with alopecia say, what have you been using? Have you got a cure? And I haven't. I literally am just happier and it's just come back. Whether it's going to stay or not, I don't know. And I, as I understand it, he has even got his own Twitter page. It has, yes. I'm a big Twitterer. So I started up um, a Gil's, um, Gil's Fluff Report, I called it. So I used to put pictures of, like, one patch and put it on, and then it started being a weekly thing. So. And loving your life, too. Yes, I have. Yeah, I've got a new boyfriend, so a um, bit younger than me. Oh, uh, you see, okay. it's, it's great, isn't it? Life's marvellous. <laughs> it's so good, I know. Don't touch him. My there, goodness, how much has he got? He's got a lot of hair, a lot more than <laughs> I have. But, yeah, no, it's all good. He's lovely. He's got a lovely family, so, yeah. Yeah, so... I keep thinking yeah, I know. it's all going to go I wrong. know, the trouble is, there's not an awful lot of wood. You can just kind of touch my head. Yeah. Um, so, and, and you had, so you've had no treatments, no nothing. No and treatment, unfortunately, no nothing. you can't give any hope to alopecia sufferers on that side, apart from the fact that you thought it was never coming back. Yeah, I and did. it has. It has, so I'm very fortunate. Great and stuff. You know, it's just hair at the end of the day. It is just hair at the end of the and day. As long as you've uh, got your health and your happiness. So. Exactly. Well, thank you very much. Thank An inspiration. You. Nice having eyebrows again, though. It's <gasps> so nice, because I did feel a little bit like someone had dropped me out. When you've got no eyebrows and eyelashes, it is quite odd. Yeah. And you do look very different. But, but thanks for coming in. Thank you for having Turn me. Turn off your new look.